Hello world and welcome to the insanity! <laughs> Alright, so this is me. I'm gonna show you the real me. Not some character, not some fake persona. It's all just gonna be me. I'm gonna talk about things that interest me, things that make me mad, things that make me happy. My sons. This one is Ethan, and there is the one upstairs. He's playing video games because he loves video games, like me. That's Jackson. You'll probably see him eventually at some point. You've seen him on the other videos if you go to the other uh, Insane Shane. That is me as well. Uh, or that is I. No, that is me. He was mad, so I put that in. Oh, let me just, you just, you know, you don't, you don't need, you don't need this. Let me just, you don't need, give me, oh, where's that? Just gonna throw that back there. So I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna stop every minute and a half or so, two minutes, because my lips get off sync from my video. So my audio is off sync from my video, and I don't like that. I don't like to have a lot of edited material if I'm just gonna talk, but I do want to have my lips in sync. I don't want to look like filthy horror with about four minutes in. It's like this. And guys, I. You uh, love what I'm doing here, or whatever. I don't know. That's that's what it looks like to me. And so I'm gonna cut now, and then we're gonna start talking about some interesting stuff. Well, maybe not interesting, but stuff nonetheless. As I was ra waiting for this to start up, I realized that uh, he was now chewing on this, <laughs> the pacifier holding device <laughs> that clips him on there, and he wants it. He won't <laughs> let go. He wants it. Give me that. He just wants to hold it in his mouth. Oh, there he goes. He's out. He's leaving. You don't want to stay? You don't want to stay? But what I want to talk about, what I, what, what a couple of things that bothered me as of late. Go down. I'll see you. Bothered me as of late is I recently, I go to these, uh, I like mixed martial arts. And uh, the UFC is the Ultimate Fighting Championship. And I like to go to the message boards and boards and kind of cruise on ShareDog, which is one of the sites. And I usually don't, I've never started a thread. Ever if I started a thread, I usually just post every once in a while, you know, hey, that's a good, you know, good point, or I don't like that point, or whatever. Well, I decided today to post, start a thread, and I did, and it had to do with one of these videos on YouTube. There was a camera phone from the UFC that had um, a different angle from the elbows that Tito Ortiz smashed down on Shamrock, and I didn't think it was a good call from the ref. I thought it was questionable until I saw this video from this video phone. The video is crap, and I say that when I start the thread. I say the video is crap, but it gives you a different perspective, and it made me change my mind about the fight. So I did that, and these people on these message boards really start to make me mad. Because even if they don't have anything intelligent to say, they'll say like, your post is crap, and that's it. They don't want to add anything intelligent to it. So they just say, your thread is crap, the video is crap. Yeah, I say that when I started the thread that the video was crap. Okay? So, big whoop. Alright, you got me there. I already said that. Why don't you look, go back and read it? It makes me mad because they come and post just like they do here on YouTube. And they just want to say you suck. Or they, they don't want to add anything intelligent to the conversation or the debate or about your videos or about your threats. All they want to say is, you know, something stupid to make you mad. And it's ridiculous. If you're not going to say something intelligent or something, add something good to the conversation, then shut your mouth and don't post anything at all. Don't type anything. Just realize you're an idiot. So you don't need to type anything. Okay, okay, okay. I realize that I talk uh, sort of fast. And uh, I do that on occasion. That's the way this is going to be. I do appreciate you coming here checking out my videos. If you don't like it, that's cool. This is just going to be me talking. If you want to go to Insane Shane Plane, that doesn't make any sense. But if you want to go there, I'll hopefully make you laugh or at least entertain you. I hope that this entertains you. But I'm not going to try to be funny or I'm not going to try to do anything, you know, crazy. I just want to be me and talk. I just want to vent. I want to have a vent. I want you to be my vent. Will you be my vent, please? Right? Get that out of there. Will you be my vent? That's all I want. Just a vent. And I'm trying to get and keep these videos under five minutes. That's my goal. Because I don't want to go seven to twelve minutes because you get bored by then. You may already be bored and that's great. But if you're not bored by now, great. Keep watching. But it's going to try to stay under five minutes because that's ridiculous. If you're going way over five minutes, some of these, like Blunty, I really enjoy watching his videos. Zen Archer has some really good stuff. And they can go over five minutes, and I'll watch them because they're interesting. 
If you're not interested by me, that's cool. I don't have a problem with it. You don't have to watch. You can comment and tell me I suck. But just like I said before, at least add something intelligent to the conversation. Tell me why I suck. Tell me that you don't like my hair. You don't like my son. Tell me something. I mean, don't just say, you're an idiot. You suck. I mean, it's, you know, it gets old. Whoa, there it falls out of the chair. I thought it was Britney Spears there for a minute. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> okay, only one more thing, and then I'm out of here. Because like I said, I want to try to keep them short, but I want to keep them interesting. So one thing I've been thinking about for the last couple of days is another child was left in a car here in Tulsa, Oklahoma, uh, while the mom and dad went into the doctor's office. And they forgot about the child. And this, they, that's what they said to the police when they questioned them. They said, oh, we forgot the child was in there. We forgot the child was in there? You forgot the child was in there? Isn't that like a mom with the baby in a room saying, oh, I forgot the child was there. She's nine months pregnant. Nine months pregnant. Oh, she forgot the child was there. Of course she did. That's ridiculous. Hold on a second. Let me put it down. I think he's going to get mad, but that's all right. I forgot what I was going to say. <laughs> mm, I'll just pause here for a second. I think I was going to say, oh, right. Well, the child was okay. Thank God. A lady was near there, and she heard the baby crying, so she came and got the baby out of the car and then called the police. And I think that if you're a parent and you leave your child in the car and forget about him, and I can understand if you go into your house for a second and realize, oh, I forgot, but it should be a point about five or six seconds into the, when you walk into your house or wherever you're going. I understand people make mistakes, but you should realize about five or ten seconds in that, wait a second, something's not right here. I'm missing something. It's not like you forgot your keys on the coffee table at your house and you locked your keys inside when you're outside. It's not like that. No, it's not. It's completely different. And I think if that happens to you, you should be locked away and your kids should be taken away from you. It's ridiculous. It's not always going to be funny here, folks. It's not always going to be funny. I'm going to try to keep things topical and have fun, but it's going to be serious. It's going to be serious here. Not always serious, but I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Have I gone over my time? I think I'm way over five minutes. First video, I can't even keep it under five minutes. That's for, that, what do you? That's great. That's great. Well, that's all I have to say for now. I guess I could. I'm going to pause it and think of some clever sign-off. It's going to be awesome. So hold on a second. And then I'm going to go back and put an awesome sign-in. Blow your mind. zippity doo -dah, Have a great day. That's the end. See you next time when I come around. Until next time, America. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. <laughs> Bye.